as spring turns into summer, on Badagong Shan Mountain in Shang Jiaji, in the primeval forest over a thousand meters above sea level, the many mighty trees, when viewed from afar, seem to have numerous white doves in their branches. This is one of the world's best known rare plants, Davidia involucrata, a deciduous tree in the family Nisaceae. It has white sepals, resembling a dove extending its wings. Since it is only found in China, it has been dubbed by Western botanists the Chinese dove tree. From the streets of Geneva, Switzerland, to the front of the White House in the US, artificially cultivated dove trees can be seen as ornamental plants. Few people are aware, however, that their wild ancestors are only found in a few valleys in central China. Dove Tree Bend on Batagongshan Mountain, with over 150 hectares of dove tree forests, is one of the greatest concentrations of wild dove trees on Earth. Such a great concentration and huge extent is rarely found for wild dove trees. As a species, the dove tree has survived many hardships during the late crustaceous period and tertiary period, it was found in many regions across the world. But during the Quaternary Ice Age, it began to die out in most of its habitats. Batagongshan Mountain in Shangjiaji is located on the highland stretching from the east of Gizhou to the west of Hubei, partly guarded by the Wuling Mountains. It was spared the direct assault of the glaciers. Its unique geographical location allows the region to keep a relatively stable, natural environment that is suitable for the survival of the dove tree. The dove tree is very demanding in environmental conditions. It cannot bear direct sunlight in open areas. Especially in low altitude regions, the heat of sunshine can scorch its delicate leaves and wither and kill the plant. Luckily, Dove Tree Bend in Shangjiaji has cloudy weather throughout the year. The cool and humid air has allowed the species to thrive and multiply. In May, the dove tree enters its flowering season. It actually has no petals. What are mistakenly called petals are actually two sepals. The position of the sepals is of vital importance to the procreation of dove trees. Before the blossoming of the flowers, the sepals are green in color and attract no interest from bees and other insects. During the flowering, the sepals turn white to send inviting signals to insects. As a substitute to the absent petals, the sepals serve to enlist the help of insects for pollination. The sepals also help protect the pollen. As rainstorms are a frequent occurrence in Shangjiaji, rainfall during the dove tree's flowering season poses a lethal threat to the delicate pollen. The two sepals are like an umbrella, keeping the pollen from rainwater. These ancient plants are no less resourceful when compared to animals and humans. Today, many countries and regions around the world import dove trees from Batagongshan Mountain in Shangjiaji. The Chinese doves, once secluded in the mountains, are now carrying a mission of peace to all corners of the world. <laughs>